I think I just caught an oblivious fly and I just stepped on him, so uh, yeah, he can't come in our house anymore. So, but that's besides the point. So today we got the W.O. Toys 10428 or Viterra Twin Hammers. It's basically the same thing, but it's not the same on the inside. Ba bam. Okay, so you're probably wondering what the crap is going on here. So we got Traxxas 3S ESC out of a TRX4, Servo out of a TRX4, which sucks by the way. 1400 million power battery 3s uh, metal spur and metal pinion that was kind of hard to find and a bearing didn't fit in the middle so i put the middle of the stock spur gear in it so it actually fits uh dynamite motor the old one burned out stock one burned out <laughs> whoa i almost fell okay uh traxxas three channel receiver with a rustler uh receiver cover on it Traxxas stock TRX4 tires and I modded them by taking out that little ridge that, that makes it conform better and it makes it grip better because it claws. Is this thing on? There we go. All right, finally got the body on and today I'm gonna test it on these hills. One hill, pretty easy. Two hill, medium. Third hill, uh, it's pretty easy but not that easy. So, do 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 do, down, down, down. Let's go to the first hill. And if you haven't already, please consider hitting that subscribe button. We're almost to 100 subscribers, and I'm really happy. Okay, so look how slow this thing can crawl. That is slow for a brushed motor. That is crazy slow. And it's got boosted ground clearance because of those tires. Loads of grip. Loads of grip. I think that's a snail. <gasps> it's a snail. Weird. <gasps> it's actually in there. That's cool. And loads of clearance going up. Look at that, it doesn't even touch. It's too easy. Too easy for old W.O. toys. All right, this hill is pretty massive. TRX4 could not do that. It just flipped over every single time. TRX4, I think it could do this right there and everything else, but it flipped over so first let's oh man the steering radius on this thing is so bad because that servo i got one on the way but i'm pretty sure it's shipping from china or something so we got good side hill really good articulation pretty good grip oh we're lifting a wheel straight in the air oh that was a close one all right just gotta get back on level ground wow TRX4 couldn't have done that. TRX4 would not have done that. I'm telling you, it would not have. Believe me, go watch my old videos and I tried it. They're pretty new videos, actually. All right, steering radius, absolute crap. Servo doesn't have enough power to turn this thing. All right, this wall is pretty steep. Not a lot of grip on this entire thing, so. Oh, wow. TRX4 could not do that. And my TRX4 is modded the crap out of it. So, oh my, oh, oh flip off. Yes, it did flip off. Oh, battery came out though. Dang it. That's <laughs> another time. Yeah, no. This is actually my X-Max remote, but you can pair it with like any Traxxas EXC, I think up to like, okay, okay. I'm gonna say nine, cause I don't really know, but I, I thought I heard somewhere it was like 20 or something. Okay, yeah, that's too easy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, here we go. Other line, super slow, but I don't really like to take it that slow because it's kind of boring. Ooh, man, that's really good, actually. This thing could beat the TRX4 in some areas, but not in steering. Oh, wow, this is like vertical. Okay, there we go. It's just struggling for grip. I mean, it has, it has everything else but grip. All right, come on. Oh yeah. Top speed around probably uh, five to seven miles an hour. But it's pretty good, actually. Just right there for a crawler. And it's got second gear, but I have to change it out manually. Oh wow, that was great. That was amazing. What the heck? I didn't expect it to do that good. Dang. 
This WL20 is pretty capable. I mean, look at that. So, it's kind of hard to understand what you're actually going up right now. But that is literally vertical. The T-Rex 4 couldn't do that. It couldn't do that. Well, I almost died. Crocs don't have that much grip. Remember that. Okay. This is nuts. This is actually nuts. That is straight vertical. Almost. <laughs> Let's see if it can make it up some super hard stuff. Like that. Wow, that's impressive, honestly, if it can do this. Okay, okay, it can do that. I'm kind of looking near the hard side. Alright, it doesn't have the belly clearance for that. Oh! <laughs> that was cool. Alright, maybe we take it a little bit to the left. Lack the grip, but maybe a little run up. Yep. Oh man, this thing's pretty good, honestly. Honestly, at this point, this thing costs almost as much as a TRX4 stock, but <laughs> still just as good. Wow. If y'all could be, oh wow, that's cool. If y'all could be here in person and really see what this thing's like, it's actually amazing. The steering is the only thing that lets it down. So let's go to one of my famous wood piles and crawl. A little bit of run up. It doesn't have the belly clearance for a lot. Or the steering for like anything. There we go. That is really hard. You can get this thing to go real slow. Oh man, it's pretty good. Okay, we got a big dip here. And we got grip. Oh wow. Didn't work either. There we go. That's not good though. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, we got a nice cross axle in the back. L plenty of articulation in the rear. Not loads in the front, but uh, I guess the back makes up for it. Look at that. It's such a great car. Like, it really isn't bad. You just gotta lock that front diff with something, and you're good. Back, 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 back. Just make sure you don't take it too hard on this little truck. Uh oh. I think I'm screwed. I'm just gonna save it before it goes over. Oh, see, body came off. Woo! Oh, it's really pushing. Whoa, that's awesome! How many clearance is what you got? Oh wow! So far, it's doing better than TRX4. This is almost competition, I would say, from a noob's point of view. Wow! The TRX4 could not do that. I'm not lying. It did do it eventually, but it didn't do it that fast. Yeah, don't want to break a drop shaft. Okay. Uh oh, <laughs> I'm gonna save it before I break yet another drop shaft. Ah. It's just high centered. Oh crap! Just got myself in a hole. I don't think I'm gonna get out. All right, I need to take a leftward approach and then turn right, but I don't have any steering. Oh yeah, there we go. Now, there's one thing where the rear axle does kind of take a spill. It will make you flip over if you have too much flex. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. This thing is good. Like, actually, it's... Oh wow, look at that rear axle. Wow, that's nice. Honestly. 
when that new servo comes it's gonna be a beast and I'm talking 46 kg what this thing is doing it in like one one swoop TRX4 fell over like a bug on my arm TRX4 fell over like a literally a billion times but the thing is the body never came off Got a bunch of dirt in my crock. That's not the motor cogging, that's me. No, I don't know why this is like this. It wasn't like that before. Huh. I wonder who with this wood pile. It's tied to me. Oh, whoa, that was close. I can't believe this. This thing is good! Amazing! It's, it's actually... Oh, what the... There's a dog in my yard. Get out! Why are you in my yard? Out. Bad dog. I'll call my mom. Dang neighbor's dog just comes over here and thinks he owns the place. Next time that happens, we're gonna have to tell him something or either do something to that dog. Like yell at it or something like that. <laughs> not hurt it, not hurt it. Don't, no, I didn't say hurt, but that's animal abuse. But there's that one dog across the street though. Well guys, that was all the crawling I was gonna do for today anyway, so no harm done. So guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I don't really have anything to buy into, so bye.